tissue has various types, including loose connective tissue, which exists in the lamina propria of various organs. Dense connective tissue can be either regular or irregular. Embryonic connective tissue includes mucus and mesenchymal tissue. Special connective tissues include adipose, reticular, and elastic tissue. This slide is gallbladder, which we use to describe loose connective tissue, where the distribution of fibers and cells is uniform. With higher magnification, you can see loose connective tissue covered by epithelium. In loose connective tissue, numerous blood vessels are visible that contain red blood cells. Lymphocyte can be seen in blood vessels, connective tissue, and epithelium. Fibroblasts with a clear oval nucleus and clear cytoplasm are visible. Fibrocytes with a dark nucleus are also seen. The purpose of this slide is demonstration of plasma cells with eccentric nuclei and a clock face appearance along with fibroblasts and scattered collagen fibers. Sometimes smooth muscle cells can be seen. Next type of connective tissue is dense connective tissue which can be regular or irregular. Collagen fibers are abundant in both types. Tendons are examples of regular dense connective tissue, where collagen fibers run parallel to each other, intermix with loose connective tissue. Fibroblasts present in tendons are referred to as tenocytes. Skin includes the epidermis and dermis. The epidermis is stratified squamous epithelium. The reticular region of the dermis consists of irregular dense connective tissue containing short collagen fibers. Elastic connective tissue is the next type of the connective tissue where elastic fibers are abundant. This tissue is present in the walls of the blood vessels. An example is the aorta where a large number of the elastic fibers are present inside. Elastic fibers are visible in a form of wave-like pattern. White adipose tissue is made up of spherical or polygonal cells that are in contact with each other. The cytoplasm of the cell is occupied by fat. And the nucleus is visible as a gemstone under the membrane. Adipose tissue is similar to a beehive. Reticular connective tissue is the next type, which is present in organs such as the liver, spleen, bone marrow, and lymphatic organs. Lymph nodes are examples of this tissue, where the stroma is reticular connective tissue. With higher magnification, thin and delicate dark fibers are visible, stained with silver.
The final type of connective tissue is embryonic connective tissue, especially mucous connective tissue, which is present in the umbilical cord. Wharton's jelly is a gelatinous substance that contains collagen fibers and cells. Blood vessels in umbilical cord are protected by this jelly. With higher magnification, numerous fibroblasts along with collagen fibers are visible. 